Hi, and welcome to Wig Studio One. I'm Eileen, the Crazy Wig Lady, and today I want to show you this wig, Ellen Villa Elite. It's part of the Hair Power Collection, and it is in light champagne mix. Before we get started, I want to remind you, please join us on our private Facebook group, Wig Studio One Wig and Topper Support Group. We have wig sales on Sundays, live wig sales every other Sunday, lots of fun things, so please join us there. Also on Instagram, we post every day on Instagram and on our Facebook business page, Wig Studio One. So be sure to join us on all those platforms. Okay, I want to show you Ellen Villa Elite. This is such a nice bob. Uh, it's a very popular bob for uh, Ellen Villa. I can't wait to show it to you. So let's get started. Okay, Ellen Villa Elite. What a classic bob. Just beautiful. It has this front of seven inches. So it has a long front. The crown is nine and a half. The sides are seven and a half. The nape is three and it weighs 2.8 ounces. Lots of movement in this wig. I like that. I like these longer sides and back. It just gives it that true bob classic style. And this color is really pretty. I've not, I don't think I have reviewed this light champagne mix. If I have, it's been a long time. It is a non-rooted color. So if you uh, like non-rooted shades, you might really enjoy this. Really pretty. Also, I want to remind you, please see the description box below for information on discount coding for this and many other wigs at Wig Studio One. And be sure to just go to wigstudio1.com for this and all the other beautiful styles they have available there. Okay, let's have a look at this color and outdoor lighting. Okay, let's talk about this color in indoor lighting. Really pretty. It's a mixed color. It has platinum and light golden blonde. It comes in 13 shades. It is very blended. As you can see, these different shades of the gold, light golden blonde mixed with platinum. Very light shade. And like I said, no rooting. Now you could root this wig if you wanted to, but this one does not have any rooting. And it has a beautiful, beautiful Ellen Villa lace front. So gorgeous, so realistic. You know, that being said, you could wear this easily off your face with a headband. Now, let me show you. That's my bio hair, so I would probably use some uh, blending powder and just blend that in. And if I was going to wear it off, I would just put down some hair over it. You'd never know it, never tell it, never even know that was there. Easily do that because it's such a pretty lace front. Why not show it off, right? You can, of course, wear it with glasses. Now, on this one, it is so low density. Very, very. If you are looking for a low density bob, this might be your wig. It is so low density and sleek. I love that about it. Uh, also, I think if you wanted to steam this up and off your face, you could easily, easily do that. Like I said, with glasses, yes. Now, this being so low density, it might not work that well with glasses on top of your head. I have found that in my experience. If it's a very low density wig like that, sometimes they won't stay on top of my head, but I can wear, the, wear them, of course, easily. My glasses, easily with it. Now, let's see. With this lace front, I tend to just like to wear my hair clipped back just like that to get it off my face. You could also use a little styling spray. You've seen me do it many times. Just hold it up and spray it just a little bit just to, like I said, get it back just a little bit if that's how you like to wear your hair. This one has, like I said, the front of seven inches. If you wanted to cut a wispier bang in this, you could easily do that as well. Be really nice in this wig. And then just a regular headband and wear it down. Lots of different ways 
you can wear this. It has enough length, I think, to make it really versatile. This might be one that you could even do maybe a little half up and half down look. Let's see. Yep. So lots of, lots of versatility in this wig. Okay, let's have a look at the inside of the cap. Okay, the inside of the cap of Ellen Villa Elite, as I said, it has a small amount of permatease here. Very small. Beautiful lace front into this left mono part. Closed ear tabs with stays, open wefted, closed nape, non-extended, Velcro adjusters, lots of stretch. And that's another thing I wanted to mention to you. I have a 21 and a quarter inch head circumference, and this actually fits me large. So I can easily use this to take it up and make it a little snug. As you know, most Ellen Villa wigs are petite average. I find this one runs a tad large. And here is another look at the color Light Champagne Mix. Okay, I hope you enjoyed this review of Ellen Villa Elite. Such a classic bob style. Again, please check it out at wigstudio1.com and be sure to follow us uh, on Wig Studio One Facebook page and the private Facebook group, Wig Studio One Wig and Topper Support Group. Thank you so much for joining me, and I'll see you next time.